Hi, my beautiful souls. How are you guys doing? And happy Valentine's week for you guys and happy proposed day. So I've laid out three cards here, if you can see from the Love Oracle deck. So these cards, you can choose one from these three cards or two from these three cards to find out if you will get a proposal from someone or someone is uh, in love with you to find out if someone is going to come to you today, talk to you today, or at least like uh, maybe if they're shy, are they going to at least text you or something like that. Okay, so this is just a fun reading and take it as it resonates, guys. Be ready to choose one from these three piles, okay? And no, uh, it's not like, please don't take it seriously. It's just for fun. Take it in a very um, jolly manner, okay? So now I will be picking out the, for the first pile. I'll be tilting the card. Oh my God, okay, so... I see here that if someone is going to come towards you, it is going to be for fun, okay? So this person will not be with you forever. Maybe you, someone else is going to propose you on actual proposed day. But this person, especially this person whom you're dealing with now, <clears throat> or who comes to you now will want you to or they want to have fun with you maybe even a little bit physical connection with you but nothing more so beware of this energy if you're willing to be ready for that then it's good or this person might you and this person might start off in something physical and that might lead to something more emotional okay so that is also for some of you guys. For those of you who picked out the one, the card number one. For the card number two, it's just a short message. So you can watch it if you like to watch because it's just for fun. We have the better you are, the better it is. So sometimes you have to stick it through the storm. So I see here that today you want people to recognize you. You want people to look at you and then you don't get the recognition. Or I see here that when you picked out this pile, you deeply want someone to propose to you and therefore you chose this. But then after the after you chose this and after the, hearing the message, you definitely feel like you should you should have never chose this. Because I see here that nobody will want to talk to you today or will talk to you. But in the end of the week on Valentine's Day, something special is coming for you. Because sometimes you have to stick it through the storm to get a rainbow right so that is the energy for this reading i mean for the for those of you who picked number two you have to just uh, stick it through the storm to find the rainbow in the situation so if you don't face the storm then there won't be no rainbow okay so for those of you who chose the card number three don't run so fast that you can be caught you can be a big fan of marriage, just a bigger fan of diamonds. So for those of you who chose the third uh, pile, you just want someone for this Valentine's Day because you feel lonely. Or I see here that this person will give you diamonds. They will present you, they'll even give you a diamond ring. Okay, so just be sure that for those of you who chose the card number three, someone is going to give you something that you've never had before or someone is going to love you they're going to give you a lot of things a lot of uh, mm -hmm. jewels or they're going to give you a lot of gifts a lot of money okay so whatever it is um, so i see here that whoever chose the card number three you're just wanting things from others you see valentine's day as something that you can receive gifts you can have fun so that kind of an energy is what i see here i'm really sorry for if i'm a little rude but anyways guys you can enjoy valentine's day like that also right so that is it guys i will see you all tomorrow bye Hi guys, 
guys, welcome back to my channel, my lovely Virgos. So thank you all so much for watching. Happy Proposed Day to you all. Have an amazing day ahead. Thank you all so much guys for all of your support. Keep supporting me and encouraging me to do my daily readings, okay? So if this video resonates, please give it a thumbs up and comment down below. This is just going to be a 5 minute short reading for your daily energies okay tomorrow i'll be doing a very what to say a very detailed reading for the chocolate day but today is a proposed day so i'm doing a little uh what to say i'm doing just a small reading okay so if you want a detailed reading you can go check out my monthly reading in my other channel which i have posted the link of the channel is there in the description box below. You can go check that out, guys. Thank you all so much, my lovely, lovely Virgos. So let's see what's coming up for your gentle energies, my Virgos. For your gentle energies, my Virgos. What's coming up, guys? We have the Queen of Swords. Wow. Aim. We have the High Priestess. Wow. You guys are really tuned into your energy like so well. Okay, we have the Magician card. Wow. We have the Fool card. Okay, good. We have the Six of Pentacles. The Star card. Justice card. Wow. Okay, guys. So, let me just see for your general energies first and then i will be tuning in to your love energies okay guys so for your general energies my lovely virgos so you guys are like very inspiring today i see here you guys i also see here that you guys are very protective about the people you are with today. You're motivating a lot of people. You're being very adventurous. You are very inspired by the people around you. Someone is really inspiring you in something or the other. You're being very strong. I also see here. You feel that belonging with the people around you. You feel like, yes, this, this person is really good to me. You feel like that kind of a belonging with someone near you. Or like you feel that vibe from someone near you okay guys which is a good thing right and you also feel this connection this instant connection with the people around you i also see here okay so this is all i have for your general energies my lovely virgos so for your other general energies you are like watering your dreams or like you are spending more time to get things right in your life or you're doing a lot of things that will improve your life or you're like or to say you're growing plants or like you're growing your ideas okay i also see here you're having a good aim to you're having aim in your life to do some things and you're going to accomplish that things whatever you have that passion about you're going to do that okay we have the high priestess card she is a very fine lady like you're being a very fine person with good qualities good attitudes people just love like when you're there with them okay that kind of a vibe you will be going today you're also being very intuitive people are like how how did you even know that i'm like this like how do you even find it out like and you are just like i don't know i just felt like it and that is called intuition okay so the magician we also see that you are manifesting something or you're working on something that is going to manifest soon in your lives okay so manifestation card we also have the full card you're trusting something blindly or you're being blind about some things in your life and you should have a clear view before you to before you do something okay don't simply trust things blindly instead have a good uh, view of things before you do it okay so this is for your general energies now for your love energies my lovely virgos this is definitely some kind of a soulmate or a twin flame connection i see here okay but I don't see any loving energies or something like that. 
you just need to know that this person is manifesting something in their lives they're working on something oh my goodness we have the four of cups you guys are just like watching in the mirror like i can see you guys like looking at the mirror or like what is it being sad like looking at your sad faces in front of the mirror and you're just like okay let it go like let it go this is the last time i'm crying or you're saying some good affirmations to yourselves okay if that's what you're doing please comment down below seriously okay you don't have to if it is a kind of personal situation and all okay so i see here that is what you're doing or that is like you feel like you destroyed yourself loving this person or this feel here for some of you all but this that person that is why they left you because they are your twin flame and soulmate connection they want you to be yourselves and when yourselves they will be come to you they will come towards you okay so this is all i have for you all my lovely lovely virgos thank you all so much for watching guys don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel if you resonated bye your lucky color for today is red and your lucky crystal for today is Opel bye guys see you all in the next video bye